<laughs> just pulling out of the station. And I'm like, I'll stand here. And just as I'm about to hit live, the train takes off. So I hope you're all well. I am standing by Water Gardens train station. Um, got one of our big shopping centers here. So I figured while I was out, the sun is out, I would take you all for a bit of a walk. So as you can see, we've actually got a nice sunny day for a change. So this is one of our big typical kind of shopping centers here. And I will, at the very least, take us for a walk. So that's Water Garden Station just there. There'll be people waiting for trains and sorry, buses and stuff like that here. There is a nice big body of water next to us, so I'll take us there quickly and then we'll go for a walk around the shopping centre. It'll give you a bit of an idea. We can even go and see a Kmart, <laughs> which I know have all disappeared in um, America. So here we go. We're at Water Gardens. Hello, Pug. Really good to see you. I hope you are well. Hello, hello, hello. Let's cross while we can. See, there's always another car. You go to cross, another car. That car wasn't on the street when I started crossing. Welcome to Australia. And they don't always get um, wait for you like they used to. You can hear the birds? They're here. birds in this tree. Lots of birds in there. Okay, so what I'm going to do to start with is I am going to, hello sun and fun, really good to see you. I know that was really nice, wasn't it? I could see them ruffling around in the, uh, in the trees there. I know it's a really nice day today, so it's not necessarily warm but it is sunny. Hello, Laren Love. Mega Love, shout out to you. Mega Love, shout out to you. Mega Love, shout out. Mega Love, shout out to you. <laughs> it is a really nice day. And we've got this body of water here, hence why this place is called Water Gardens. So we'll at very least see if we can spot some um, birds. And then behind me is a big shopping centre. So I'll just show you quickly before we head down that way. Hello Harvinder, really good to see you. So typical car park. There's a big library just behind me. So we've got the shopping centre and everything, bowling, cinemas, all that sort of stuff across there got a big library here and we're gonna head around behind me and see what we can find hello hello so yeah I was out and about and I thought like a lot of things let's seize the moment while the sun's out <laughs> doesn't always happen so there is a lake down here. So we're going to go and have a look. I had a really nice chat on the train as well to a tourist trover from Texas on my way. It was kind of nice being able to um, share all of my information. <laughs> and then I'm like, if you need anything, here's my card. <laughs> um, we're really good in Australia with that sort of stuff. And as you can see, the cars here aren't waiting for pedestrians. They just do what they want. It's a freaking nightmare. So, um... Yeah, cars coming at you from everywhere. So let's get out of the chaos. So down here we have... Water! Okay. Don't know, it's not looking too promising, but at the very least we can have a look. Hello, Chevy Man, really good to see you. Hello, Fallen Star. Hello, Rain Dancer, really good to see you. I hope you are well. Welcome, welcome. I hope you've got nice weather up where you are as well, Fallen. It's been um, cold, but 
we've had like rain for days and the sun's come out today so um i will at the very least see if there's any birds hanging around by the water because <laughs> it'd be rude not to so hello beat really good to see you may the beat go on I actually put some more Duran Duran tracks on my list the other day for you. I know there was a couple you um you were after. Your cloudy. Okay, here, let me quickly. Now I did unmod everyone, by the way. So if any of you have been modded in the past and you're not now, I do apologize, but I'm slowly adding everyone back in anyone that's had a channel knows what happens when you get a rogue mod oh there's some water birds down there you get people hidden in your chat um we have problems so i know there'll be a few of you let me make sure i've got you two rain dancer there we go done so there are some little herons i can see down here and there's quite a nice little body of water. So we'll at least see if we can get a bit of uh, reflection for a little while before I head back up into the shopping center. And you can see this body of water actually goes under the shopping center. So this shopping center is quite new. So what they will have done is built the whole thing around what existed before. Not here, but we do get crocodiles up in Queensland. So, I'll take us down to the water because we've got a lot of our native bluestone here as well, which I'm a big fan of. So, and we've got on the ground here all the banksia seeds you don't want to be standing on because <laughs> you will hurt your feet. Okay, so this is our bluestone we get here, and you'll see this whole little quarry here will be built from it. So, all of our laneways and stuff like that are. Uh, made from this my pleasure and this looks quite cool so I'll try to show you I don't know if you can see here but the water goes all the way under the shopping center which they've built around it I can hear lots of birds above my head hello Roke how are you love I understand love I hope you're having a good day this was an impromptu stream I was out and about and the weather was nice. Oh, I like the reflection here. So I thought I would at the very least. Oh, running water, yay. Okay, I found the little waterfall. So here we go, everyone. Yeah. I'm traversing rocks as we speak. So there we go, we got a little waterfall, a little natural, uh, slight waterfall happening let me show you where this all ends up down there <laughs> and I just get a real kick out of the fact that they built the shopping center around this I quite often look at it from the other side where you do see a few birds so I'm gonna shut up for a minute and let us all enjoy the sound of the running water Now I did bring my recorder with me. This would be a nice place to play. A nice little bit here. I know it's such a beautiful sound, isn't it? I've got my um, my steel cat walking shoe boot things on. I like watching the. Um, I love how the light ripples on the surface now I could walk over the top 
thank you. <laughs> Maybe you don't need my shadow. There's the water. So yeah, that's a really nice little, there's something about the sound of running water that calms everything. So I hope you've all been good. I hope it's been a good day. I should at the very least try to sing us something while I'm here. Let's see if we can follow the stream. Islands in the stream, that is what we are. Come away with me to another world. <laughs> Which is kind of the obvious choice. Um, Take me to the river. There's <laughs> another one. Um, my favourite river song is actually by a African group called The Oneness of Juju. And I will post one of their videos and it goes like this. River love right, sons and daughters of the universe, come together and learn to love. And mother do right, learn how to live just like your brother. <laughs> It's such a good song. So yeah, River Love Ride, it's called as in L-U-V. River Love Ride, sons and daughters of the universe, come together and learn not to hate. And brother do right Learn to love Just like your sister <laughs> So I know it makes me want to go to the toilet as well Whenever I heard this Hear this It's like Oh, duck Duck Okay, I'm going to zoom in There's a duck in here Hopefully it comes back out I spotted ducks Okay, maybe not so much. Let's see if I can find the ducks again. Yeah, I just spotted it as it was, um, I was about to say flying into the reeds, swimming into the reeds. So I'm just going to turn the camera around because I'm precariously on a pile of uh, river rocks at the moment. So here we go. I'll show you these lovely blue stone. Yeah, it's such a nice place. I didn't um, realise this little bit was here. So this is a nice little discovery for the day. And hey, this is so much better than a shopping centre, hey? <laughs> Hello, NN Vlog. Really good to see you. I hope you are well. Welcome. Okay, so we might actually go walking towards the... Um, shopping center now I'll just show you again where we are because it's quite pretty so there we go this is typical Australia particularly with all the blue stone and there's a bit of reflection heaven for me <laughs> I am obsessed with reflections on water I did significant filming of a puddle before just because <laughs> so that's the way it goes we're on a road to water gardens via the river. <laughs> We're going up to water gardens via the river. I'll try to give you some more reflection as I walk back to where we started <laughs> in some backwards water looking for birds I'm sure there's lots around us they can be heard 
That is the cross overhead Saying you may pass my friend you may pause hello mary <laughs> spirit knows that sound we all do they say you may pass and we saw you that is why we all say mate can you hear? Oh, there's a pretty bird doing a water bomb. Okay. That was cool. Don't know if you can see this little bird flying around in front of me. It's a little New Holland honey eater. Oh, there it is. And back in the water. That was really cool. Hello, adjust your focus. Really good to see you. I hope you are well. Thank you. It's a really nice little, um, little spot. I just noticed there was water here, so I'm like, okay, let's go have a look before I go to the shopping center. And I love the fact that this bird's like diving for food. Let's have another watch. And I love all the concentric circles it forms on the surface of the water. Thank you for performing for us, little bird. You're very cool. Hello friends of Samuel, really good to see you. I hope you are well. I hope you are well. <laughs> I'm the food? Yeah, that's probably right. <laughs> I have oats in my bag, so maybe they know. They're like, right, that woman's got food. So there's a little drain down here where all the water comes out of. Oh, little fish down there. I don't know if you can see the little tadpoles. I can see the surface moving. I can see them under the water. There's little tadpoles and stuff there. And then the unfortunate part is there's also a heap of rubbish here. So we have a huge problem with stuff flush into our waterways. People aren't as nice as they used to be. It probably is oats. Yes, I've got oats in my bag. <laughs> I, I travel with oats for the magpies. <laughs> so I have a bag of, um, a little bag of oats. Oh, and there's a balloon over here too. Let's go find the balloon. The very least we can kick it. <laughs> I don't know why I have the urge to kick the balloon. Ka, ka, ka. Oh, that's hilarious. That's so true, spirit. So true. Okay, look, there's a random balloon here, so let's at least um, move it on its journey somewhere and see if I fall over while I try to kick it. <laughs> the odds are looking pretty good. Here we go. That didn't fall over. didn't go anywhere. Nope. The balloon is not playing along. So the crows are up there. So let's at least... Send it somewhere different. There we go, the balloon. Because <laughs> why not? Whoever would have thought that we'd find a balloon sitting here. I can see some more ducks on the water just up ahead. But they're probably a little bit too far for you all to see. And a random shopping trolley that's been left. <laughs> There's a cart <laughs> right there. Which makes me think of bubbles out of the trailer park, boys. So there we go. Here's a really... I'm going to head towards the shopping centre now. But just to show you the extreme, you know, we can go from this beautiful water to a big concrete jungle. <laughs> yeah, it's a rugged balloon. I know, exactly. Exactly. It's probably survived a kid's party too. The crows are up here. You always get lots of crows and magpies and cockatoos here. So on that note, let's head back up 
to the shopping center through the gum trees give me a home under the gum trees with lots of plum trees a sheep or two and a kangaroo veranda at the back a hill so I sat the front and an old rocking chair <laughs> I got them in the wrong order but that's okay we don't really care so there we go a little bit of suntan and nature for everyone and then we've got more of our blue stone here which is some of the stone we quarry here which i'm a particular fan of more birds up here <laughs> i liked your uh, crow jokes <laughs> it's like only going forward because we still can't find reverse that's like one of those things. <laughs> okay, I do apologise. This is beginning to be a tad shaky as I walk here. And more abandoned carts because, you know, why not? I do apologise as well if I've missed anyone coming into the chat, so I can't always see when I've got the sun in my eyes. But there you go, trolley number one. Trolley number two, a little bit better placed. <laughs> Looks like it had a bit of a spin before it went down. And there's sun and birds up here. Oh, I can see it. There we go. It's a crow. Of course. Ah, oh, nice. I hope it's going well, love. And we were going to um, potentially sing a bit later on as well. So we'll see how it goes. So let's take you down the other side. And another shopping trolley. <laughs> That's one of our supermarket chains. And you have to put money or tokens in them because everyone just leaves them. <laughs> so that is one of our problems. And I think that problem happens kind of everywhere now. It's not so much just an Australian issue. So, so there we go. That's where we were. And we're going to head into the shopping centre. So we would have been started at the train station over here. We've got a library ahead over here. And a lot of cars that don't know how to park. It's feral car parks here. Like no one waits for anyone anymore. It just becomes a real, you know, <laughs> try to get out in one piece. Thank you. And that's one of the things I love about the fact that there's always birds, plants, everything like that. So here you go. I'm in the state of Victoria, so all of our number plates will say Vic on them, whereas where Spirit is, they'll be yellow and they'll say NSW on them because <laughs> they're in different states. So here's some... Um, public art that would have been done here. I dare say that's Mary McKillop in the mid-centre and I don't know who the other people are meant to be. It's a nice place here so this is a lot busy. This is sort of the closest busy shopping centre to where I am. It's about 15 minutes drive, 10 minutes on the train. Um, all of our oak trees and stuff are all, we're in autumn so everything's getting that nice yellowed oh birds birds everywhere it's grass i'm liking the birds okay so i'm going to take you more shopping center direction now some birds We have these everywhere too, where you can tie your bike up and stuff, which is great for me. I've got a 
bike as well. So I'm often the person leaving my car, or my bike, sorry. So TAB is um, where everyone bets. So that's all your sports betting and everything like that. Buy things you don't need exactly. And what I call it, full of all of the things you never knew you always needed. <laughs> is what it is. Um, and in reality, I only need a couple of things from the supermarket. So, And we do have bins everywhere, which is one of the things I like about it here. You get rubbish bins and recycling bins everywhere. So this is some of our autumn colour. And there's a little... Uh, seat and garden here so let me show you this before we head inside there you go which will look kind of cool from the other side and there's always places to seat, sit and stuff like that and from the look of that it lights up at night there we go. There's some more uh, public art. And the train station where we started is just up here. So thank you. I really enjoy um, doing this sort of stream a lot. So here we go. They are looking for buskers. I sh could, should do it. But um, it's not a great place to busk and people aren't fantastic. So... So there we go. I do have a few busking permits around Melbourne, but not for here yet. You need to get one with each of the different councils. So this is a different council from where I am. I want her jumper. Okay, so there's quite a few little eateries here. And um, I'll show you what else we've got up ahead. There's some playgrounds and stuff like that. There's also, used to be an old piano, you could just play here too. So if I see it, I'll have a go. I'd like to show you the little playground here, but it's full of children, so I'm not going to. Um, there's some really cool things to play on. Um, okay, so we can go bowling if we want to up there. <laughs> It's some nice colour for everyone. So Hoyts is one of our cinemas, which you've got just up ahead here as the Hoyts. I can see all the birds in the eatery area. Yeah, and this place is full of Bogans, love. This is Bogan Central. So we're going to walk inside. Here's some nice little succulents before we go. So... Anjamo, which means let's move. <laughs> okay, so there's a big food court up ahead. I'll at least show you that because you'll notice that it's like every single food court, no matter where in the world you are. And I just got the big waft of fake perfume. Yeah, we have a really nice... um. A nice habitat here. <laughs> um, and I like the way the roof is open here, so you get a lot of natural light and stuff coming through. I'll show you what I mean. Oops, sorry, it just lost me for a second there. So hopefully I didn't lose you all. Now at the very least show you where all the Kmarts went. <laughs> Oh, 
Scoot and Toot, that's a good name. Oh, actually, let me show you one thing here. So we were just down by the um, water before. So this is the other side of it. So this is where we would have been looking at through the building. And um, this is the other side. So there we go. can at least see a few ducks there. <laughs> so there we go. We'll head back inside and I'll show you the food court. I'm really mindful of not filming children so whenever I'm moving the camera up it's because I'm avoiding kids. So hello everyone. and you'll find the same stuff in every food court. You won't be able to hear me for a minute, so I'm gonna do us a 360 and I'll just be quiet for the moment. And that way you can see what we've got here. Hello, Jess, I love, really good to see you. This is making me very hungry. Hello, how are you, love waves? Really good to see you. I hope you are well. I do apologise. There's going to be a few of you that aren't moderate at the moment, but I will try to uh, pick you all up afterwards. I'm going to take you for a walk around and at least show you what the food is. <laughs> Obligatory Kentucky Fried Chicken everywhere. You'll always get some of your sushi, Chinese, Thai, everything like that you'll always have. making me hungry. The pizza place is gone. We lost the pizza. I hope you are well. So we always have these big food courts where you can just buy what you want and sit down and and there's always McDonald's. <laughs> We'll at least show you the equivalent menu here. I do like this roof too. So we have a sizable queue. So at the moment they'll be mainly doing breakfast menus and stuff like that, I'm assuming. There you go, so they're gonna be the same no matter where in the world you are. And bins everywhere. So let me also show you what we have down here. And I was talking to a guy from Texas this morning and he was telling me that he was amazed to find that all the Kmarts were here. <laughs> um, so we have um, a lot of them here.
and you'll see up ahead one of your long defunct institutions in the form of Kmart. <laughs> I know, and Kmart and Target are actually owned by the same people here now. So they used to be different stores and now it's all um, owned by the same people. So these are our Ugg boots, which we all live in. And we can't even use the word Ugg here because some stupid frickin' American trademarked the name. Don't get me started on Ugg boots. Hello, John Love, how are you? Every Australian has a right to call them Ugg boots. Um, and that, anyway, don't get me started. We don't even own them anymore. Um, hello, Boss Block. Boss, mega love shout out. Mega love shout out to you. Give me a second, I'm going to at least show you. I was going to hope the Off Your Tree will open, but I don't think it's closed. Off Your Tree is where you buy all your... Oh, here we go. All your bongs and your paraphernalia. I, of course, want that. <laughs> so, there you go. But I will show you just up ahead here because we speak about them often. So most, our biggest sort of chain of, is the, um, hello Edward, really good to see you, I hope you are well. Welcome, welcome, welcome. So what we call treaty gear. <laughs> so there you go everyone, Kmart is still breathing strong in Australia. So most of them have gone, um, hi everyone, sorry. Um, I clicked on the chat, uh, someone put a link in the chat that I just clicked on and it took me entirely out of my stream. So, um, yeah, there we go. So I do apologize everyone. Um, that is a trap I now know not to do when I'm streaming. Um, so here we go. I'm gonna take you back down the other way. I don't want to do that again. Um, all, all of a sudden, I was in someone else's premiere, and it's like, oh my god, what's going? Sing you a song? Okay, give me a second. I'll head outside so I can sing us a song, and I'll walk around the outside for a bit and come back in the other entrance. So, sing us a song. You're the violet person walking around a shopping center and you'll make up lyrics as you go along cause that what the violet one does na 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 this is what our post offices look like but it's closed at the moment so we'll take a look through the window na 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 there you go it's the violet one Singing while she walks There's a crow in front of us Having a squall And chasing a minor bird There are the crows <laughs> Ready to sing My! <laughs> there we go, we came out into bird wars I love our crows. <laughs> I know, right? You're like, screw that crap. So here, let's have a look at our crows. Hello, babies. Were you chasing off a minor bird? Hello. How are you, Odyssey? Hello, hello, hello. 
So Odyssey and Mum and Dingo are in South Australia. We've got one, two, many crows. Let's follow this one for a little while. Doing the crow strut. Come on, crow, fly for me. I just want to see you do your thing. Oh no, we lost it. <laughs> Come on, crow, fly for me. Yay! Thank you, crow. That was very nice. You are most obliging. <laughs> um, that was Eagle Rock there, and the other one I was singing was Piano Man. <laughs> there you go, because um, why not? So let's walk around this way and we'll sing a little bit of a song. As you can see, it's quite a big car park here, and you can never get a park here. So even when I visit here, I get the train. There's more crows. Um, Office Works is ahead, which is like your staples. So all of your um, uh, office, well, office works basically, all your office stuff. So there's a plane just leaving up ahead there, which will have just come out of Tala Marine. Or Tala, <laughs> depending on if you're Aussie or not. We like to shorten everything. There's some more crows. And you can probably see why I love bird watching so much here as well because they're everywhere. And what I've learned with birds, they just like to be seen. So if you look up and acknowledge a bird, they're happy. Most people just completely ignore them. So when someone actually stops and looks up at them, they, they play along, which is what it's all about. So what, I'm just gonna check the time. Okay, so I have another um, train to catch shortly. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to walk us back through the, where we were before, through the food court, and then I'll take you back out the other side again. And one of the other things you'll see, there's always little areas like this where you can sit down, park benches everywhere. We always like uh, that side of it. A bit of funky tunage going on. Break time's over, I know how that one goes. I'm on smoke, eh? Leave me alone, I'm on smoke, eh? Leave me alone, I'm on smoke, eh? Which means break in Australian. Here's another crow up ahead. <laughs> that was the chats who were fantastic and I need to learn how to sing that one better. They do another song called Yeah Nah, Yeah Nah. <laughs> um, so there we go. I don't know if you can still see the crow just up ahead. There's some flying overhead here. So there we go, one last little dose of sunshine before I head back inside. There it is, right over my head. Hey baby. Hello. You may pass. <laughs> okay, so we're going to head back inside. We've got two up here watching. There we go. All oh, beautiful. Two more up there. See, the birds are playing along today, which is a nice change. So there we go, nice little look at the outside. So a lot of our shopping centres are like this. They're kind of big and sprawled out with a food court in the middle and, um, you know, places to sit and eat around them and everything like that. So here we go, from one extreme to the other.
So I hope you've liked this little walk around. I thought at the very least I had 20 minutes to kill. So I'm like, you know what, I'll do you a, uh, a quick stream. Thank you. So I do have a sing stream scheduled later on for when I get home. I also tried out band camp yesterday for the first, so not band camp, band labs. And I've created some tracks which I've released. I'm going to, I'll post them a little bit later. I've decided to do an album where every single sound is made by my mouth, including all of the percussion. So I've called it vocal percussion. I've done a little scat track already. <laughs> and um, I'll do some more of them for you later on. This is making me very hungry. I'm sure everyone's the same. <laughs> Oh, it smells good. Okay. I know. It's making me really hungry, spirit. <laughs> really hungry. So I'm going to head back out again. This is the little area where we were before with all of the restaurants and everything like that. Your little outdoor dining section. So they've got a little outdoor stage, which will be where they want the buskers to perform. Um, I am vaguely open to it, but people aren't good with buskers anymore. They don't give, they don't stop. They just film you and walk on, <laughs> is pretty much what happens. So, some really cool play equipment here. It's got that really springy kind of um, ground that they, oh, there's a bird, pigeon coming in for food. Smart pigeons, or turtle doves, depending on uh, which way you want to look at it. Hello, hello. So there we go. Some of the little opportunists, <laughs> and you can see why the birds like this area because they get stuff to eat. Ah, let's go around this way. I used to like eating out a lot. I'd always be sitting sitting at one of these outdoor venues. But I find on a global level, we're all kind of finding the same thing, that they're not friendly anymore and the prices have got so obscene that it kind of takes the pleasure out. There's a really good dumpling place here, which would normally be where I end up. <laughs> so I am a massive dumpling fanatic. I even told the person today that I met on the train, they had to go and do a yum cha, get some good, uh, good dumplings. So, yeah. Okay, so there's that sign again. So I hope everyone's enjoyed this. It's been um, fun on my side of things. I am gonna head back up to the train station and get myself home <laughs> and as I said I am doing a stream later on um, an open mic with Hug and anyone else that would like to join please do um, it will be a bit of fun 
and I hope you've liked this little dose of crowd ambience, birds, water, quirky Aussies. <laughs> Too many people in my way, <laughs> all the usual stuff. Oh, my pleasure. I'm really glad you liked it. And I, I do like doing these ones here. We've got the suns just come out here. So we started over at the water down here. Oh, thank you so much. I really appreciate that love waves drifting forever. That's so nice. Yeah, we're the, um, exactly, exactly. Woke up this morning, rise, smiled with the rising sun. A lovely person in the UK bought me a coffee and I really appreciate that gift from you so everybody thank you for joining me on my singing scaffery there's a really cool building I'll show you here before I go and get my train <laughs> And I'll be back for another round Later on, after I'm home It would be nice whoops, to see all of you <laughs> See, that's how the day has gone So everyone I hope you enjoyed that. Here are some buses and some other things. I've got to cross to the station. Then I'll show you the facade of the building that I like right here. Okay, I've got seven minutes until my train comes. So you've got a couple of minutes before I'm going to love you or leave you. I love this green here, by the way. I just really like the facade of this building. <laughs> I've filmed it a few times. So this is what our buses look like. And I'm about to head into the train station. So thank you so much everyone. It's been an absolute delight. I'm really glad you uh, enjoyed it. <laughs> I'm glad you liked that song. <laughs> a bit of Bob Marley for you. Um, I'll take you up the stairs, so give me a second, I'll at least see if I can show you the platform. Okay. Let's make the most. Okay, we've got the 28% battery warning. So give me a second, everyone. There's a nice view here at the very least. I can get you. So here we go, this is just overlooking the platforms here. So I'm going to head over to the platform over there and grab a train. My pleasure, I'm really glad you enjoyed it. A bit more sun. Okay, so let's take you the last of the journey. I'm really glad you like this. Yes, exactly. Let me just grab my mic key out of my bag. So this is what our tickets look like. There we go. Take you down the platform. This has all been redone recently. This section here.
Sausage planting's 38 minutes. What? That can't be right. Crap. That means I just missed a train. Okay, we've got a V line coming in. Here we go. This is our regional trains. Crap. I don't quite know how I managed to miss my train. Um, so I'm in, I'm in Melbourne, Victoria. So what I'm gonna do, cause I've got a bit longer to kill than I thought I did, damn, is um, we're gonna head back up this way. I'm probably not gonna have enough battery to keep going for a while, but I will double check. Um, damn it. So there's only a train every 40 minutes, so it means I've got another sizable weight. Um, let's just make sure of that. 37 minutes. Bastard. Okay. So on that note, everyone, it's been a huge amount of fun. <laughs> um, we might go and sit down the other side. So, saying I have time to kill now. <laughs> Shit. Um, bugger. Sorry, I'm just a bit annoyed. <laughs> means I've got to sit here for another 40 minutes, um, which is my own fault. <laughs> no money's fault but mine. Okay, so on that note, I'm going to go and charge my phone up. Let me see how much on battery I'm on. 23%. Okay, there's a train coming in now. see a little bit of it. Well, thank you so much, everyone. That's been a huge, it was a lot of fun. I hope you enjoyed it. And um, I will see you all a little bit later on for some singing. A little bit of singing, a little bit of silly fun. <laughs> I'm going to go hop in this lift because I've been walking for an hour. And my feet have now decided they're going on protest. <laughs> they're like, no. No, 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 no. So. Come with me. <laughs> Hopefully I don't lose you. You have entered the twilight zone. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> and I got to make someone laugh. <laughs> so there we go, everyone. A um, little bit more of the sun for you, a little bit more of the sky. And I am going to sit down, have a cigarette, go and get the next train. So much love all of you and um, I will see you all in the next round. Now, Marilyn, I think, is still live at the moment. So I'll go and hang out there for a little while. So if anyone wants to continue the party, please head over there and I'll come across and say hello myself. We've just hit the hour mark. So there we go. I'll leave you on this particularly nice gum tree. <laughs> Like all of us Aussies, we are 
Gumtree Obsessed. Thanks so much for joining us. Adjust your focus. It's been a lot of fun. I hope you all enjoyed this. Mega love shout out everyone. And I will uh, see you in the next round. This is Australia.